Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Going Medieval. So, hold on a second, we got research available. But we unlocked everything. Tall gate, I think this is new. Alright. I don't know what that is. Um... When rapidly under attack, gateway closing. Oh, cool. All right, so I think we just got these unlocked. And we can unlock both of these. There we go, all right. So, now I'm questioning, like, is that gate gonna be good enough? <laughs> I wasn't expecting an update, actually, like, I didn't I don't usually boot the game up through Steam on a regular basis like that when I'm doing the series and stuff so this is interesting let's take a look at these new blocks so it should be under possibly defense no it's not under defense um, would it be under doors maybe so that's the uh, gate we have the ornate gate and then the other one and ah uh, yes so let's see how this would operate okay so that would be the part coming in and that's the part that closes is right there yeah that might be a little bit hard to uh, set up there like, we don't have quite a lot of room to do that. So we're going to have to definitely rebuild that gate um, next episode. There's also these smaller ones as well. Yeah, I'm not sure. That's um, four blocks in total. These are These two are two blocks each. Huh. Okay, then we got these really tall ones as well, which are also two blocks. That's pretty cool. Um, we'll have to consider redoing that and try to get a area in here. We do have that extra line here that we can work with. So we could make something work. But um, probably not this episode or season. Because we only have... Uh, today and tomorrow left but I want to
All right, so the next thing that I want to work on is just a area over here behind the farms for basically putting that wolf in and we'll see if we can't fit that in today um just a small little one story barn should do uh we still need to move the donkey pen as well um not entirely sure where i want that just yet um especially with the the gates being a new thing i'm not sure with um where i want to be putting that so um we didn't really leave that much room in here to put the donkeys if we wanted to. So, yeah, I don't know. Um, eventually, I want to finish upgrading this entire thing. But now, given that there's gates and stuff, we're definitely going to have to rework this uh, area a little bit more. Uh, we might be able to fit it right in here, these parts. And that will leave that extra one there. That could work. We might have two of them. Not sure just yet. Actually, if we do the, the inner part, I'm not sure how it actually is technically supposed to work. If we have our gate on the outside here, we might be able to um, build it over on this side, the, the part that goes down. That might work. I'm not sure. And then for an extra layer of defense, we could have our wood over here if we need it. I don't know, we'll, we'll have to experiment with it and see how tall and everything it, everything gets, but right now I'm just telling them to chop down these trees over here so we can get a path in, and we'll start building, um, actually I've been also taking down some of these older buildings as well, so for this one I still need to get some of the flooring and stuff removed, the door. And in time, I want to remove this, and then we probably will keep this as green space. Uh, we'll plant a couple trees and stuff in here, I think. That might look really good uh, with some trees going along the church area. And then that will also take up some space for the, um, what do you call it, the area, which will kind of help with just general planning because a lot of these buildings are a lot larger now they're not as small as they used to be so we can fit a lot more in too right so i don't know but i want to remove this one so we have a little bit more room that's basically what i've been working on i'll just uh tell them to remove these walls okay i don't want those walls removed just make sure i'm not selecting anything else
Alright, so I started working on a new apartment complex. Uh, we're going to be putting one right over here. And I figured that will be a good little spot for them uh, to be because we have all this. We have the other one right here. And I was thinking about doing kind of like a... Um, hard to explain. like Kind of like a overhang kind of thing that goes between the two buildings. And rather than have the path this one go all the way down there what we can do is we can bring it this way and that should leave a pretty good design for buildings on this side as well as on the other side uh, because it's about measured where we'll need to build the buildings and stuff so I think that's what we're going to do um, now with this path coming down here I'm not entirely sure what I want to do with it just yet because I'm going to be moving these buildings in time. Uh, this was the old, um, what do you call it, the textile place. We still need to move these somewhere. I was actually thinking that we could move maybe these over on to these parts or um, keeping it, let's see how far away, this cold storage is way over there. So we could build it in here and over here maybe and then like right where the complex is over on these parts that might be an option as well I will have to consider it and think about where I'm going to be putting everything I'm not entirely sure where I want everything to go but we are going to need a little bit more space for the blacksmiths uh, buildings for sure so I'll, I'll need to consider where I'm going to be putting it just right now I'm not sure at the moment but we'll take it one step at a time this is going to be the church over here for the church of restitution we'll probably be doing that in season three building a new church I'm not sure what kind of design we might build it out of bricks instead and have a limestone roof just to kind of separate the church a little bit from the other one and give it a different style but I was thinking about the same layout that one turned out really good so um, we'll probably do the same thing just um, with bricks for the main part and limestone for the secondary for the roofs and stuff but um, yeah that that that's part's going to be occupied and then we have all these houses and stuff back here that we'll need to figure out and that storage for the logs that we have at the moment but uh, yeah so we could definitely put the blacksmith in here maybe or something I'm not sure just yet but we'll We'll figure it out in time. Um, just needing to get this building built first. And speaking of which, we should probably get that. Alright, so I forgot to mention we got a new settler. Uh, there is a 
bandit somewhere around on our map over here. Just chilling. He's waiting for a negotiation. I just barricaded the door because we're probably not going to have enough time tomorrow to finish some minor projects and um, deal with that. So I uh, just barricaded the, the door so we could not need to worry about it. And um, yeah, so that building's coming along really well. We got uh, just a tiny little project going on, but I uh, will be getting a couple rooms built in. We're going to be moving this one and getting our new settler, um, Catherine, uh, to occupy this particular building once it's complete. So that way we'll be able to um, free up the building here and get them out of the small room up in the church. And then we can start focusing on demolishing this, planting some trees or something like that in here. And I think that will look really good once it's done. And then I think that will be pretty much what we can do for uh, next episode is just finish up this building, demolish that. And um, if we have time, then I'm going to try moving this barn uh, somewhere else. But I'm not sure if we'll be able to have time to do that. So... Uh, might try to put it over here. I'm not sure. I'm trying to get as much stuff moved around as possible. Now, the other option is to keep the cattle f cattle barn here and put the donkeys here instead. And then we, what we can do is we can go ahead and just move the cattle over here. That might work actually better because uh, then we can move this barn and then we can expand finally in the future for the... Um, what do you call it? The uh, we still have uh, the woodworking for the wooden tools and stuff like that. We have bows set up in this building, but I wanted to expand this so we have the um, the the wooden tool uh, weaponry and stuff. So hopefully we can do that next up or in season three. I don't think we'll have time for a next episode. But if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Comment down below. I have a Discord server if you're interested. Uh, the link is in the description. And I will hopefully see you last episode tomorrow. And thanks for watching. Peace out.